Hi, I'm Jesse with Thumper Fab. Today I want to show you how to install your Defender wireless phone charger onto your dash. The spot we chose best for this was right here on the dash on the passenger side. You'll need to start by removing your factory box and you go right on the corner of the dashboard. Now if you have a limited model with the air conditioning and heat, you will need to lift the air ducts up out of the way so you can drill your hole. Now we can mark our holes with a marker or a pencil and we can pre-drill the pilot holes for our screws. Now using an eighth inch drill bit, you want to drill your pilot holes for your screws. Now it's time for you to run the wire to your cordless charger. <clears throat> we found that the best place is to drill a hole in the very bottom corner of the passenger side area. Uh, you cannot drill directly under the mount because there's some honeycomb plastic work in there. If you want to run it differently, you can. Now you can put your ball mount base onto your thumper fab bracket using your socket cap screws that come in the kit. Now that you've tightened your base plate, it's time to put your bracket onto your machine. Using your Phillips head truss screws and a number three Phillips screwdriver, you can start your screws into the pre-drilled holes in the plastic. Careful not to over tighten so you don't pull the plastic through. If you have a larger phone, this mount is adjustable by these five Allen head screws on the back of the mount. Now you can take your knob arm out of the kit and place it on the ball. After you take your knob arm out of the kit, take your, your phone charger and place it on the other side and tighten at once. Now you just simply plug up your wires to the charger, pulling the slack out. Now we're going to run our wires to the other side where we can hook up to our accessory bar right here. Now that we have completed our install, it's time to put your phone in and hit the trails. <laughs> 